good morning, hi. Before we start our read aloud today, I actually have a game for us to do. Now this book is actually a bit of a game. Um, the author and illustrator, her name is Mary Claire Gawler, and she has made this book into a game. The title of the book is Guess the Animal. Watch this. A little bit of a clue. What kind of animal do you think it is? Do you have ideas already? Okay, well, this is gonna get you. Well, I wanna show you one page at a time. It has ears, which you already saw. Look at those ears, pretty big. Come on, get that detective hat on. It has fur. Okay, what are you guessing? Okay, okay, let me give you another clue. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is a good one. It has eyes. Look at those eyes. Is this a creature that lives in the water? Is it a creature that lives in Grandview? Is it a creature that lives in the forest? This is gonna really help you out, ready? It has feet. Uh-oh. I bet some people are guessing now. Ideas, what do you think? Does this creature live by your house? Okay, this is gonna give it away. It has a tail, look at that tail. Oh, this is cute. It has a pouch. We've talked about this. See the baby in the mother's pouch? Do you already know? It is kangaroo. So it gives us labels here. The fur, which we saw. The eyes, the ears, there's the little pouch, the feet, and the tail. I love that. I have a couple of these. We'll do another. I hope it tricked you a little bit. Okay. Let's get to it. I got a read aloud today. And I got two fun things after this book too. So the title of this book is Hello Penguin. Looks to be nonfiction. Definitely see a photograph. Huh. I don't see a table of contents. However, it says vocabulary tree. And it gives me some words. Animals, penguins, where they live, on the ice, on the beach, in the forest. What they do, huddle, shuffle, slide, swim. What they look like, big, small, fancy, plain. Fancy? I'm interested to see that. Okay, let's see. Looks like I see, oh, what? I see all kinds of photographs here. Oh, at the very end, see a little bit kind of uh, information about the different ones we're going to learn about. I definitely think this is, I see labels. I think for sure this is a nonfiction book. Okay, let's get started. I can't wait. The title of this book is Hello, Penguin. One name down here. Catherine Williams must have taken the photographs as well as written the text. Hello, penguin. I love it. Hello, penguin. He has his arm on him like he's just saying, hello, penguin. That's cute. It's cold. These penguins live on the ice. They huddle to keep warm. It says down here the label. These are emperor penguins. They huddle to keep warm. Now look at them, what are they doing? What do you think huddle means? Yeah, they just stay really close together, huddling up, getting cozy. There are many kinds of penguins. This kind lives on the beach. They make nests in the dirt and the sand. Now wait a minute, these guys don't necessarily live where there's ice. It says they are Magellanic penguins. Hmm. These penguins live in the forest. They waddle over tree roots. What about that? Snare penguins. 
I don't see ice anywhere. So all penguins don't live where there's ice. Some penguins are big and some are small. So we have a emperor penguin and a fairy penguin. Give me a thumbs up if you've ever seen a real penguin before. Have you been to the Kansas City Zoo and saw the penguins? I bet some of you have. Some are fancy, there's our fancy, and some are plain. Look at that. This is a rock hopper penguin, and this is a Adele penguin. That's cute. I love that. Okay, which one's your favorite? Point to your favorite. Penguins can't fly, but they can shuffle. This one is a chin strap penguin, and you see right underneath his chin, looks like there's a little strap. Look at him sliding on his tummy. They use their wings to swim. Splash! Look at that, he's diving on in there. There's our label. Adele penguins. It's time to go fishing. This penguin gets a yummy fish. And this is a Humboldt penguin. So looking at this picture, what kinds of things do you think penguins eat? I think they probably eat a lot of fish, definitely probably meat eaters. After a swim, it's time to go back on land. Hello, penguin. Oh, this is cute. So this is a Gentoo penguin. Looks like that's a mother. And look, here's all the different types of penguins we saw. So we have the emperor penguin. We have the Magellanic penguin, the snares penguin, the fairy penguin, the rockhopper penguin, a deli penguin, chinstrap penguin, Humboldt penguin, and Gen 2 penguin. Here's all of them. Okay, so the very next page is something for you to do. Can you believe this book is giving you homework? Bottom. Your turn. Draw a penguin. Now tell a story about your penguin. Where does it live? What does it do? If you draw a picture today of your penguin, see if your parent will take a picture of it and put it on Class Dojo for me to see, or even Facebook for me to see. Let me see your penguin that you drew today. Okay, I have one more fun thing for you to do about penguins. The Kansas City Zoo has done something pretty cool. They have put a camera where the penguins are and it's videotaping the camera, the videotaping the penguins non-stop. We can see the penguins live and see what they're doing right now. At 10 o'clock tonight, please don't be awake at 10 o'clock tonight, you could get on and see what the penguins are doing right then. It's all the time, 24 hours a day, we can check out the penguins. So in the comments today, I will put a link to see the penguins live here in Kansas City. Okay, so today, draw a picture of a penguin. See if somebody will post it and share it with me to see. I want to see it. Write about it. Wait a minute. Are you saying, but I don't know how to spell penguin. Blump, bump, bump. Pull this video back up. Here it is. Write about penguins. Draw a picture about penguins. Show me what you did about penguins. And I'll make sure I share some links with you today. Have a good day. See you later.